Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. Today I'm going to be trying out some Alphalete Amplify Shorts dupes. These were sent to me, so thank you so much to Seller for sending these my way to try them out. Um, but I will be giving my honest opinions on how they stack up with the Alphalete Amplify Shorts. So, and thank you to all of you for watching these videos so that I'm able to have these awesome collaborations. So let's jump right in. The shorts are made from at least 50% recycled materials, so they are actually recycling bottles and other ocean waste. The material is made of 53% nylon, 37% polyester, and 10% spandex, and they will be coming on Amazon in 14 colors for just $28.99. And so my samples finally came. I'm really excited. So they actually sent me the Sonic Boom color, which is so gorgeous, and then Northern Lights, and I wasn't sure which colors were coming, so I'm really happy by the ones that they sent me. They also came in these reusable packages, um, so that's kind of cool. They have little snaps, so you could reuse that for something. I do reuse a lot of the bags that my activewear comes in for different things, so I will definitely find a way to use these. The black are my Amplify shorts that I have, and it's definitely important to compare how much of each type of material they have. So Amplify has 51% polyamide, 38% polyester, and 11% elastane. And then the sealer has 53% nylon, 37% polyester, 10% spandex. So totally different in terms of what they contain in their fabrication. The sealer does say that it's made with a minimum of 50% recycled plastic. So that's really cool. I don't know if Alphalete does anything like that. In terms of the feel, I'm trying to see what I think. Like, it's weird because they kind of feel the same. Like, my brain knows they're made out of totally different things. But in terms of like the thickness, that feels similar. Let me try the green. I don't know. Like, they kind of feel the same. I have the longer Alphalete shorts, and then these are probably more like the four and a half inch, so I won't be able to do like a direct comparison in that way, but I should still be able to tell kind of like how the waistband fits. They do have a very similar scrunch butt, so this is the Alphalete scrunch. It's kind of hard to see on the black, um, but it's pretty much identical. Like I held them up to one another, and they're pretty much the same in terms of like how long it is. So I'm curious how that's gonna fall when it's actually on. They do the same kind of waistband where they have their branding. You know, the Alphalete does the exact same thing. I have worn the Alphalete's and washed them once. So I have heard like when you do a waistband comparison, if you've already worn it, it's gonna be hard to tell if they're the same um, because it's obviously gonna stretch out. So the sealer looks a little bit smaller in the waistband. Wonder, let's hold up the pink to the green too, just to see if it's like consistent. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely consistent from color to color. Um, and again, the Alphalete looks a little bigger, but I have already worn them and washed them and I did put them on because I'm wearing, I'm wearing these this week from one of my outfits of the week. Um, so I don't think that that's like a fair assessment because they're not both brand new out of the package. All right, so I'm really curious to actually put these on. Um, they do look very consistent from color to color. You know, the inseam looks the same, so that's nice. So let's try these on. Here are the green. It's such a me color. I'm so excited. Um, they fit a little bit longer than I was expecting, which for me is a good thing because I was afraid they would kind of feel like they would ride up. But I think on me, the length is perfect where they're hopefully gonna stay put. The waistband definitely feels very secure. Maybe not quite as compressive as the Alphalete band. I don't know. It, 
it feels like just like the teeny tiniest bit lighter, but not in a bad way. I still feel like they're gonna stay put. They're gonna be really comfortable. Let's check out the bomb. We've got the scrunch bomb. Um, I do feel that sensation that like, it feels like just a teeny bit lower in the back maybe, but I do have the tag still on. So I guess I could have taken that off and maybe that would make a difference. Um, but just that scrunch, like you do feel it. Like I feel it. Um, and I do feel it in the Alpha Elite too. So that's not anything different. Um, it's a little bit like, I wish I had Alpha Elite in a color cause it's a little bit hard to tell in terms of how it's looking compared to the black because the black obviously is going to like hide anything you know but they have the little panel up the side um the alpha elite has that too where it's like a little bit more meshy i love the green so much they're so cute um they do feel really good though and like i said they do feel like they're gonna stay put um if we do like a little oh my knee is like a little off right now uh, a little squatting like you know that wasn't anything crazy but they're really not moving around I don't have a fear that if I were wearing this for a workout they would be like riding way up like I can't stand that um, I mean they feel really good obviously I would have to do a wear test in the gym but just based on this they feel good so now Let's try out our pink ones. Here's the pink, such a me color. These are so perfect. The color palette they offer looks really pretty. I can't wait till they actually come out. The pink feel pretty much just like the green. Really, really cute. Let's look at the bomb. Got that scrunch. They feel great. Like, it's funny because I'm glad that I recently got back into Alpha Elite because I think it's like making me like these even more knowing that I like the Alpha Elite Amplifies. They just feel so smooth. Um, let's see, they've got their mesh, little mesh down the side. Seamless material, of course, um, no front seam. So if that's something that you try to avoid, you will definitely like that and they just feel very secure. So I will definitely have to add these to the rotation now that they're here, um, see how I like them in different types of workouts. I could definitely see myself just like wearing them to go for walks, you know, like I just like to have like a nice light pair of shorts. It's getting really hot where I live. I live in Boston and the summers here are really hot. So I could see these being really, really comfortable just with like a tank top or like a baggy t-shirt or something like that. Obviously a sports bra would be great, but really enjoying these. I'm really glad they sent them. I'm curious to see what other colors do come out, but the ones that they sent, I mean, the pink and the green are just so perfectly me. It's probably what I would have chosen anyway. So I'm really, really happy. The cool thing is they did add me to this Facebook group and they've actually been asking us, like all the people in the group for feedback, which is so cool. So they are coming up with the color palette and they were asking our opinion on that and then different styling things. So I've really enjoyed that. That's like right up my alley because I try so many different brands and so much activewear. I feel like I really have a sense of what I like and not that what I like is what everybody likes because we all have our own opinions, but I'm really enjoying giving the feedback. Um, and it's been really fun. So I will link anything down below that is relevant and helpful. And thank you so much to Sealer. I'm hope, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, um, for sending these. I've really enjoyed the process and I'm so excited to try these out and share them with all of you. Thank you to all of you for your support. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like. Make sure you're subscribed, especially if you like activewear and activewear dupes and things like that. And I will see you in the next video soon. Have a great day, stay positive, bye.